Hi everyone, welcome to Sonali's Home Foods. Today we are preparing super yummy nachos which can be a staple at every party because they are so tasty that everyone just loves them. Nachos can be prepared anytime for any party and especially for Super Bowl Sunday which is this Sunday. My boys requested me to prepare this so I will be making it for sure and sharing this recipe with you all so that you can give it a try too. So let's get started. First let's preheat the oven at 375 degrees Fahrenheit or 190 degrees Celsius. Take some tortilla chips in a baking dish. These are store bought ones. On this let's spread some refried beans. I have recently shared a recipe for refried beans. I will be attaching it in the description below. Or you can of course use the store bought ones too. Now the next layer is of cheese. I am using the Colvijack cheese over here but you can use mozzarella or cheddar if you want or a combination of both. Use as much cheese as you like. Add few slices of jalapenos. If you don't like it spicy you can skip this. We will pick it in a preheated oven for 15 minutes or till the cheese melts. I baked it for about 15 minutes and now you can see that the cheese is all melted. Next we'll spread some salsa over this. You can use the store bought one like I am or you can also make fresh one with fresh tomatoes and onions. Unfortunately I didn't have enough tomatoes at home so I'm using the store bought one. Next we'll add some sour cream. And now we will add some chipotle sauce. This is completely optional. If you like it, you can add it. This is a homemade one too and I will be sharing a recipe for this very soon. But you can easily find this in the grocery stores too. And now let's add some Tabasco sauce. This is very spicy, so please add it as per your liking. And now let's sprinkle some chopped green onions. And now our nachos are ready to be served. You can customize this dish as per your liking. The most important are tortilla chips, refried beans and salsa. The remaining things you can add as per your liking or delete them. I hope you'll give this recipe a try and do let me know how it came out. If you like this recipe, please don't forget to hit on the like button. And if you have not already subscribed to my channel, please do consider subscribing. Let us meet very soon with another recipe. Till then, please take care and stay safe and enjoy the Super Bowl this Sunday.